If you want to win the game with women, Grandpa, you first have to learn how to play the game. I'm too old. I'm going to teach you every trick I've got. Step one, reconnaissance. First, you need to identify your target. I go for a nice-looking, intelligent girl. How about her? Who I think can keep up with me intellectually. Step two, the approach. You have to have her meet you. Plan spontaneity, Grandpa. That's the name of the game. You're covering me? You know, I bet I'm better at this game than you are. I don't think so. And how are you this fine evening? Sooner or later, you would get sick, and I'll be the one that has to decide whether or not to take you off of life support. Hey, Joe, I'm Edna. <gasps> Thank you. Step three, the buildup. You got to get her interested in you. You have to wait until she calls you. You can't let them know your true feelings so soon. That's my boyfriend. Stupid, dumb, idiot plan. You're just afraid of getting hurt. I'd rather feel lonely than to feel this way. He's like a brother to me. Did you know that Joe is a wonderful kisser? What I got to do is turn things up a notch. By next week, she'll be mine. She won't even know what hit her. What kind of girl do you think I am? Are you trying to seduce me? What do you think? It's alive. I don't have any protection. Protection from what? Have you ever heard of a black market drug called Viagra? Oh. I said anything about playing fair. But I love you, Edna. Oh, there, Joe. You are like a wild stallion, and you must run free. I just got a new start on life with those pills. Once this word gets around the home, the babes are going to be begging for me. You're a retirement home gigolo. My phone won't stop ringing. I've met three chicks already. I kind of like her, and I'm blowing it. I'm not interested in a friendship. If you want to win the game of love, maybe you should stop playing games with women. I kept going and going and going and going. Actually, I think I might still be going.